Hi, it's me, Vamp. <clears throat> and I, as you know, or may know, I decided to add, you know, two more days to my regimen of making videos. So, now I post videos every day. Monday through Friday. Well, you know, and sometimes Saturday or Sunday, depending on, you know, random gameplay videos. I tend to do those regularly, so, yeah. As you know, I decided Tuesday is going to be my day. I'm going to just relax, do a segment I like to call Transmute Activate. Um... And, well, today, on Thursday, I was like, oh, for the longest time, what should I do? What should I upload? What might be interesting? Well, there's a little thing I do on um, <clears throat> my stream, when I stream, on my, you know, on my stream every Monday, Wednesday, Friday around 9 o'clock. Or a little bit earlier sometimes at twitch.tv backslash spam 6 x 6 x 6 x Nailed it. But yeah, anyway, I pick a planet. <clears throat> Lately, I've been doing Setna, but I pick a planet. I pick the defense mission. Um, Lately, I've been doing Hydron. I go in public, yes, I go in public, <clears throat> or friends only if I had a whole bunch of friends, but yeah. And then I do <clears throat> wave or nothing, or sometimes I do, um, you know, le relics or nothing, like, you know, a certain amount of relics or nothing. What I mean by that is, you know, if I don't, <clears throat> I can't extract till I either get that relic or, you know, the mission ends in the failure. And I can't, or I can't extract till I get the wave and the mission ends in the failure. Excuse me, to make it a little bit easier on myself, I give myself teammates at first by going public. <clears throat> but then, even if they leave, I can't leave until, you know, I either complete it or die. <clears throat> Today, when I make it easy on myself, I'm going to go with 30. No, no, I'll go with 25. No, just 20 to make it easy on myself. But in the future, it won't be as easy on myself. In the future, I could pick a void um, <clears throat> defense. I could pick that I'm looking for a certain relic instead. I could pick 40 waves. If you guys have suggestions, suggest them to me. It will always be a defense though, this um, segment for now, <clears throat> which I like to call or nothing. It might be other things in the future, but as of right now, defense is... Defense and interception are the only missions, as far as I know, that you can actually leave, um, you know. You could stay, even if everyone else leaves. Um, yeah. <clears throat> so... That's what it will be. And as you see, I got to stay to wave 20 right now. And like I said, in the future, it could be a certain relic <coughs> that I need to get. Or, you know, if I don't get. And then the relic ones could be super hard. <coughs> I know what you're thinking. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm clearing my throat so much. You're thinking, hey, Vim, how could the relics be hard? Well, on the relic ones, yes. And G could be like, hit the relic right away. But, 
also keep in mind that Anji could be like, you're not going to get the relic till wave 75. <clears throat> and I realistically can't make it to wave 75. <clears throat> so, I'll die before I get the relic. <clears throat> ah, I don't know. I just finished eating for this closet, so I probably... Yeah. Actually, guys, hold on a second. Okay, I turned off the mic for a moment to clear my throat. I'm using a headset. I guess that's the beauty of me using a headset for this. Wow, if I'm struggling now, then how much am I going to struggle once we get to the higher wave? But we are only going to 20 to give myself a break. Now I should really do, be doing more thrust shenanigans. I mean, we're only on wave 3, so we really have to step up our game. <coughs> And, oh, if you guys have any frames that you guys want to see me survive with, go ahead and recommend them. And, you know, I may do it. I used to have a challenge mode series, but to be honest, I mean, I can still potentially do challenge mode on some Thursday or whatever. I'm not like, you know, set in stone. Oh, I have to do this one thing or nothing. I'm not as simple as that and I am not doing my job. I have one job. Okay, anyway. But yeah, it's not as simple black and white as that. I can do this segment. Or, you know, if you guys have a challenge mode for me, I can try the challenge, but chances are I'll fail. I'm not real good at this game. But, yeah, these, um, you know, um, let's see, or nothing things, I think, I think it's real good. Like I said, if you have a frame recommended to me the other day, I used Frost and got to wave... 30, but you know, I haven't used for that was on stream. I haven't used for us not on stream to do this, so you know. The good thing is, I'm the host, so we shouldn't host migrate. It's a little disorientating when you do host migrate. For me it is. I don't know about for you guys. I haven't even had to start using my so yeah. We haven't even made it past wave 5. Me and my teammates need to step up our game. This is 20 or nothing, I have to stay. Even if they won't leave, I have to stay. Nope. Guys, stay. It looks like I'm on my own. Till we get to wave 20. Continue to defend. You will be rewarded for your bravery. Hopefully I am. Bye everyone. It was nice seeing you guys. Now I'm all on my own. Oh, and in the future, if you think it's something that you guys might want to jump in on, just let me know and I can, you know, make these friends only so, you know, people can join. You know, just let me know. And, you know, if you want to see me try it with a certain frame, just let me know. And, yeah. I mean, I guess 
these or nothing things are like a mini challenge mode thing I guess. Definitely not forever because eventually you guys will get bored of seeing me do certain frames but I feel like this also helps me challenge wise you know challenge myself get better at the game in general and who knows in the future we could um potentially combine this with some planes of eidolon thing like you know certain things i have to do in planes of eidolon or nothing but you know, I don't know too much about Planes of Eidolon yet, so I can't say too much. If only I moved this fast when they were here. Dun, 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 dun. I've had that song stuck in my head. Mad Hatter. I actually know the one of the four parts. Um, let's see. I think I I get wrong sometimes, but I know the pre-chorus and the chorus. You know, let's go with it. Um, let's see. Let's see. Hold on. And. Let the unpeel my face Cause I hate being safe The normals they make me afraid The crazy they make me feel sane I usually I do a smooth transition from that to the chorus but <clears throat> let's go let's <clears throat> huh let's see <sighs> okay here we go <laughs> let's see I'm bonkers baby I'm maha <clears throat> Let's see, I'm bonkers, baby, I'm mad. No, no. <clears throat> I know it got something like, you know, the craziest friend that you've ever had. You think I'm, you think I'm psycho. You think I'm gone. Tell the psychiatrist something is wrong. Over the... <clears throat> Over the bed, those, um, ha, I had it done packed, but you know, let's just ignore my failing. I'll probably end up watching a video or looking up the lyrics after this video, if I'm being honest. But yeah, if you want more singing with vamp, you can watch my stream. Again, twitch.tv backslash, um, you know, VAMP666XXX. I stream not only Warframe, I'll admit I do a lot of Warframe, but I also have other games like Overwatch, which I suck at, but I still have it and still stream it from time to time. I stream Monopoly sometimes. I like a good Monopoly. Once Planes of Eidolon comes out, I'll be streaming that a lot. And that's somehow I magically don't like Planes of Eidolon. Which if I don't like Planes of Eidolon, I don't know what's wrong with me. And I have to find a way to do this faster. Because right now it's taking forever.
We already said 20 or nothing, so, you know, we have to do 20 or nothing like we did. Only I would try to snipe with a shotgun. I think it's taking so long because I'm getting all these focus things. I might not get them as much in the future. Who knows? Plus, I'm learning about target priority in this game, which is a good thing because target priority is important. Nope, Lotus, I'm staying. The guy stay. Keep it fighting. is my destiny. To extract will appear soon. Oh yeah, and if you want to restrict certain weapons, like, you know, that you don't want me using doing this thing, I understand. To be honest, I'm only using the tech for two reasons, or three reasons. One, it's a lot better than I thought. Two, I am um, trying to level it up again. And three, it's because of the simple fact that I put a greater lens in it. Well, because we're getting all our lenses refunded when Planes of Eidolon comes out, so putting a greater lens in the heck seems like a no-brainer. I mean, I'm using it a lot on my Warframes. Most of my Warframes that I use already had lenses. Oh yeah. Well, you can't use profitability in the air. That's why you gave me that. Yes, I am. Okay, there we go. That was fun. And my aim sucks. So there's that.
But yeah, if this isn't the kind of video you guys want at all, just let me know and I'll try to find something else because I don't know how long this video is, but I can only imagine that it's not necessarily, you know, what you guys wanted in the video. Because I know this can be pretty long, and I know some of you tend to like shorter videos. So yeah, definitely let me know. I can just make this like mod review Thursday or something like that if you guys want. And I might still do that. Just, you know, give me feedback. I appreciate your guys' feedback. Because, you know, you guys are the viewers, the people who view my channel and support me. So, if this isn't something you guys are interested in, I'm not going to make you guys watch it. Just tell me what you're interested in. Now, I'm going to tell you, if operators get a real buff, I may be, I mean, I don't want to get your hopes up, but I may be doing this in the future in like an operator mode type thing. Because operators are supposed to get a serious buff. They're supposed to get armor, they're supposed to get weapons. The scores are supposed to help them out more. Yeah, and that has my curiosity peaked, if I'm being honest. Now, I was actually joking about this on the stream the other day, that Frost, as of right now, is literally the only frame that can be like, wait, for everyone freeze, time out, I have to reload. Rumor is the glass frame will be able to do something similar. I'd say rumor, but we actually know the glass frame's powers. All of us do. It's not like some super secret partner only info. So, yeah, I know that it's taking a while, I'll see how long the video is afterwards, and I'm still, you know, of course I'm still going to upload this, but, you know, I'll let you guys choose, I mean, there are lots of mods in the game, I could, like, you know, do reviews on my recommended mods for you guys, or, you know, Um, something you guys let me know. Yeah, definitely let me know. Or, you know, you guys could suggest a challenge mode and watch me either pass it or most likely fail it. Because I know these or nothing defenses can get pretty long, so... Definitely, yeah, let me know. And there's a knock somewhere over there, right? Ah. Okay, let's see where it is. 
Plus, I feel like not to resistant to like abilities. Not immune, but resistant. Which is not good because Nox is a newer um, enemy type. So uh, that means our future enemy types going to, you know, be resistant to Warframe ability? Is that gonna be a thing that I need to worry about? Now, Eidolons uh, apparently gonna have a whole different mechanic. You'll need to weaken them with the operator and use your Warframe to rain down Tenno Justice. I say Tenno Justice, but have they really done anything wrong? If you think about it, the Eidolons are just there, minding their own business, roaming the streets. And then we are the ones interrupting them. We are like, no, no, you can't have this food. We gotta kill you now. Oh, you don't know why we are killing you? We don't either, just go with it. Did you see that? He was still attacking me, even though he was supposedly frozen. Okay, that's what I mean by resistant. His toxin cloud isn't really a big deal. The big deal comes in the fact that he was resistant to my ability. Nope, it had to be 20 or nothing. And I mean or nothing. If I die or the pod dies, I'll be going home with nothing. I mean, I'll probably get to keep the affinity that I earned, it, but none of the bonus from the enemies. But you know, like the mods and relics I would have got, I don't get them. That's what I mean by or nothing. The items I got, the resources I got. I don't get them if I fail. I have to succeed or I get nothing. That's where the or nothing comes in. This is actually just a sample of how I stream it like on it. <laughs> I might make this another series. I would appreciate feedback, but you know, I don't want to force you guys. So, you know, I can think of something. If this, if I don't think that it's a good idea after I see how long this video is, then you know, I might do something else in the future. I'm still playing around with stuff. I decided five days a week because, you know, Warframe content just, it's growing lately, quite a bit actually. With Planes of Eidolon coming out, there'll be much to talk about, and, you know, I don't think I can fit that in just three days. All the videos, all the content, all the new mods. Yes, I, you heard me right. I said new mods. You remember those mods that, um, you know, we saw those um, from Reddit? The mod that actually dropped? You remember, it was a set mod. The first time we saw a set mod, so everyone was so excited. Well, if you watched the dev stream one time, that was 
a reward, but a different set mod. The funny thing is that same set mod we saw wasn't the reward, it was a different set mod, which makes me a bit excited. It means DE hasn't shared everything with us. They've been quite secret about stuff, which is good. I like being surprised. I want that kind of surprise that I got when, you know, I did um, the second dream. You were like, D, how do you keep this from us? I want that kind of surprise I got from Tinocon. It's like, Plains of Eidolon? Plains of what now? How do you hide this from us for so long? Which is very hard to do with data mining and all that. So I really applaud them. And not to mention, you know, the community manager talking to us regularly and, you know, having to, you know, be very vague about answers because they don't want to give anything away. Yeah. To be honest, I spaced for a second and looked over at my um, second monitor because I was like, oh, is this a stream? Wait, I got no affinity for that whatsoever. It's very hard to get zero affinity unless you literally aren't doing anything, but I swear I could have sworn I was killing stuff, but maybe I wasn't. Maybe it was my imagination. And I wasn't killing anything. The joke was on me. I made that joke or whatever you want to call it on my stream as well. I'm, I swear I don't mean to keep advertising my stream. I meant to do it the first two times, but you know, this whole talking with you guys and while doing stuff in the game reminds me of my stream quite a bit. This is literally like a segment of my stream. I just pulled out of my stream and, you know, am bringing to you guys. But yeah, like I said, I'll see how long it is. If it's too long, I will probably go back to the drawing board and think of something else for this day. Like I said, mod review Thursdays could be, you know, a thing. The Noctis are pretty easy to kill because they have a cut and dry, um, you know, headshot place. But they are annoying. You guys are probably tired of seeing me use the same weapon. Now it's time for me to break out this weapon. Yeah, you heard right, the Pandero. I actually like uh, fan firing it quite a bit. So I'm probably gonna spin.
Okay, that killed enough. Okay, let's see. But yeah, sometimes Thursday would just like, you know, be a news day or whatever. It won't always be this exact segment because, you know, I'm still playing around with Thursdays, okay? Thursdays are still a work in progress. Like I said, for now, I'm liking this, um or nothing idea but thing could change and you know I might decide nah I don't think I want to do the or nothing idea you know things change all the time I went from three days a week to five days a week. That's a big change on my behalf right there. Warframe is evolving and my channel has to evolve with it. That's how I feel. So, you know, I'm still playing around with this, like I keep saying. I'm open to suggestions, like I said. It's your, I know that it's cheesy, everyone says it, but it is the Yo Guys channel in the end. Yes, I make videos on it, but you guys are the ones that support me, you guys are the ones that watch my content. If this is a ridiculous amount of time, you guys are the ones that have to, you know, that put up, not have to, but that makes it even more impressive that willing to willing to put up with it okay so I know there's a knock somewhere there's always a knock somewhere and you play this game for as long as I have you learn that always a knock somewhere and knock that don't die easily Heavy gunner do apparently. Okay, maybe the knock died easily. Okay, ready. we can Let's extract now because we made it to wave 20 like we said we were. We got some, eh, uh, not bad loot. I know you're like, hey, Vam, this was basically a random gameplay. It was not okay it might have looked like it okay well anyway i don't need to make this video any longer than it need to be like i said i'm open to suggestions still playing around a bit with stuff for this day i'll catch you guys in the next video later